Hello everyone, welcome back to City Skylines. <clears throat> I'm sorry that I missed uh, this episode last week. I have been doing some terraforming on the map and it was really ugly. And it kind of still is. It's out here in the distance what I was doing. And so I don't know if I want to show you exactly yet. But I have added onto our city. This is the almost the complete city. This is this is the space we're going to be filling up today. So what I've done actually is I put uh, some shellfish boat or shell, shellfish docks down here, shellfish fishing harbor, and so this is a little a new little harbor alongside our oceanside harbor, which is just the uh, it's got one fishing dock and the the ferries, and so what I, I had planned out a little bit here as well. So I will have a cargo harbor area right here and a tourism. And so along with this, obviously, I was going to be de detailing that involves like the shipping containers and whatnot, and over here will like, hotels and whatnot. And then this will transition into a new city down here. So we're almost done with Oceanside. All we're going to have to do today is turn this into a little tourism hotspot. So like we have these main roads coming through, the park on parks on both sides, which are both five star parks by the way. Um, I added these little finger roads like I said I was going to. And it was a trick getting the electricity to line up, but I did it. And uh, I kind of detailed some little fields for these houses. Oh, sorry. I got the hiccups. Anyway, today we're going to take a look at this. We're going to take a look at some of the unique buildings we got. Zoo. So, Oriental Pearl Tower that does not fit this area at all. Hmm. Which one should we put in? Colossal Order Headquarters? <laughs> uh, no. Sporting goods? No. <laughs> Science Center, Aviation Club, Ooh, Academic Library. That might that that's a contender, that's for sure. The observation tower? No. Rifle Tower? No. That one might not be too bad actually. Central Park, no. City Hall, no. Art museum? No. Okay, it's between the stadium. This stadium, not not this stadium. So this stadium or which one was it? The academic library. Hmm. I think we're gonna go with the academic library. Yep, that's what we're gonna do. Okay, so we're gonna bring this road in like this, and then tie it back in right there. We'll get our big academic library. Ooh. See how that looks. That looks alright to me. And in front of it, we're gonna do some plazas. Oops. Let's see where where are they at? Are they in this? They are. Okay, we're gonna do that, that, and that, and then we're going to Take all of these, move them over a tiny bit so that they're directly lined up with that. Hmm, very nice, very nice. And we're gonna take our paths, 
kind of go along them like this. Let's see if I can. Eh. Let's do that, and then what we can do is take the surface painter. Whoa. Okay. And kind of fill in these little bits. Nope, I like the grass in there. And then we're gonna take the path again. Let's see if we can do only the grid. On that side. And that side. Move those in a little bit like that. And this is looking fabulous. I'm really enjoying the look of this. Okay, so right here in this little bit, we're gonna put some trees. Mm, I'll put the, put these nice big, no, that's too tall. We'll put some of these in. Then we'll add some Bushes. <clears throat> Add some of these. Yeah. Very nice. I've been trying to just grow the city up to until the we get the this the crematorium, but people keep dying, so it's pretty hard. <laughs> okay, so what I'm thinking is we have some nice like uh, like park fields for people to play in, and so what we can do. Is take our tree, we'll take these small conifers, and we'll kind of just do this. Come across the back. front there we go that's a nice ring around um, unfortunately there's like no smaller buildings like they're all pretty big and so we'll have to come in here big is this? No, that's not too big. I think that would be really nice on this side of the road. Like that. Delete those trees in the front. And that is a nice little bit in the middle. And now we can take our trees, these nice big tall ones, and we'll put some little groves of these trees around the place. Oh. 
We forgot our little trees here. There we go. So we'll go back to this. Just some different kinds. We'll put in some of these. Not too many. I don't want this to be overloaded with this kind of tree. Then we'll add some of the vanilla trees. Not that one. I want the smaller ones. Excellent. And let's see. I want to see if this lightens up the terrain at all. Sort of. <laughs> Why won't it? That adds a little bit, right? And so now we can go in here. Some of these around. Put some heavier bushes in. This will be a little part, like a little grove, that the mowers never come in to mow. Let's see, we can add a couple rocks. Smaller. Smaller, I said. Okay, this is coming together nicely, and I am liking the look of it. And that is it for today. Thank you so much for joining me today on this awesome academic library build. The final touch in our city of Oceanside. The city is now complete, and I might come in and put some more trees and whatnot, but that is... It is all just cosmetic at this point. This city is now complete, and let's take a look at the zone. We stayed within our zone, right? And so, from now on, these things that we do will be out of Oceanside. Oceanside is done. Whew! <laughs> I bet you all have been wanting me to move on from Oceanside for a while. But, uh, now that it's finally complete with this last little bit here, we can be done.
So thank you so much for watching and tuning in, and I hope you enjoyed our academic library build. Uh, build. And make sure to tune in next week for more City Skylines. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to look out for new videos and I'll see you next time.